Hello, I am Flash Isaac. This is Flash Lenas. You are now watching More Than 20 Days to Jam, a series containing more than 20 episodes which covers all the topics in Jam syllabus. Each episode comprises detailed class, questions, and homework. The questions and homework are from the Flash Lenas Jam application. This makes the app a requirement for this class. Visit Google Play Store or flashlearners.com to get the app. Do you have trust issues? Reach me on any of my social handles for activation guide or inquiries. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time. This is episode number 23 of the 120 Days to Jam Physics with Flash Isaac. And this is the last dance of equilibrium of forces. We are going straight to questions. The first question we have here, we are given three masses are hung from the light rod. The total length of the rod is 0 0.1 meter. That is 0 0.5 plus 0 0.5. That is 0 0.1 meters. To keep the rod horizontally or horizontal, the mass of S must be dash. So leave the grammar. We are simply asked to find the moments about this point. S is trying to put it clockwise, uh, and 1 kg and 2 kg are anti clockwise. From here, all the distance are perpendicular. So taking the anti clockwise moment or the moment about this other side, it will be. 1 kg times distance 0 0.5 plus we are taking moment about that this point either knife edge or what is holding it it is hanging at a particular point which is that should be the middle so we are finding moment about that point plus 2 times 0 0.25 so first mass times distance plus second mass times distance these two should be equals the clockwise which is s times 0 0.5 that is the condition for equilibrium 1 times 0 0.5 is 0 0.5 plus this is the same thing as 2 times 1 2 25 over 100 to be equals s times 5 over 10. This is the same thing as 5 over 10 as well. We therefore have 5 over 10 plus 50 over 100 to be equals 5s over 10. From here, 1 0 cancels 1 0. We are left with 5 over 10 plus 5 over 10. That will give you 10 over 10 is equals 1 over 2 s. From here, food is ready. 1 is equals s over 2. s is therefore equals 2. So is 2 kg there? Yes, 2 kg is the correct option. We are given this couple. Couples, they are equal and opposite forces and they are acting in opposite direction. Their line of action do not intersect, which means this force is acting here, this force is acting here. They are equal, they are opposite, they are acting in opposite direction. Their line of action do not intersect. This one is acting directly here, this one is acting directly here. So their line of action doesn't intersect. Like this. This is a couple. Now this force is inclined and this force is inclined. The distance is 3 meter. The couple of the bar will simply be one of the force times the total distance. But the force and distance should be perpendicular. We should have something like this or something like this. What do we do? We therefore resolve this force here and resolve this force here. Doing that, here 
we have 60 sine 30 degrees. Why? When, as you are resolving this here, you are expanding the angle, you are opening, you use sine. Similarly, here is 60 sine 30 degrees to give us something like this. 3 meter 60 sine 30 degrees. 60 sine 30 degrees. Cos 60 degrees and sine 30 degrees are the same. Cos 60 degrees is 1 over 2. Sine 30 degrees is 1 over 2. Sine 60 degrees and cos 30 degrees are the same as well. So from here, 60 times 1 over 2, this is 30 newton. This is 30 newton. Therefore, the couple will simply be 30 times 3. Because they are perpendicular right now. 30 times 3 is equals 90. So 90 newton meter, which is force times distance, is the couple of the bar. Not 180. You don't need to do this and do this and add both of them. No. Because since they are equal, opposite, acting in the uh, opposite direction, their line of action do not intersect. You take one of them and use to multiply the distance. That will be the couple. A meter rule of mass, 15 grams, pivoted at the 30 cm mark. Balance horizontally. To understand physics, you must also understand English. They said a meter rule of mass, 15 grams, pivoted. They did not say a uniform meter rule. They did not say uniform. For a uniform meter rule, the 50 grams will be at the 50 centimeter mark. But we don't know whether this meter rule is uniform. We are not told and we are not given. So we don't assume that the 15 grams or the mass is at the 15 cm mark. We find out. But for now, we know that there is a mass of 15 grams. 15 grams. And this, let's say, mass, a meter rule of mass 15 grams is pivoted at 30 cm. It means there is a knife edge here around anywhere you choose, but this side holding it like this. And it is at 30 cm. So from the beginning of the meter rule to that mark is 30 cm. Then there is a 15 grams here. And the distance is here to here. We are not given. We don't know whether the question will give us, but let's represent it with S. So here. What next? So it is balanced horizontally. When the mass of 25 grams was hung at the 18 cm mark. So around here, because if here to here is 30, 18 cm will still be around here. So there is 18 cm here, which is balancing it with 25 what? Grams. So this is balancing 18 25 cm grams. That simply means that from here to here is... 30 minus 18, if I am not wrong, that should be 12 cm, 18 cm. So what are we told? If the position of the pivot is moved to the 33 cm mark, so here, let's call this point A, B, from here to here has changed to 33 cm mark by how much must the mass be reduced to maintain the horizontal balance so this is 25 grams so what mass will be here mass so that this 15 grams will still be balanced so what mass must be here and if here from here to here remains 18 because we are not told that it's 10 cm it therefore means that from here to here will be 33 cm minus 18 cm. Let's look for a proper value for this distance. If we say S, there will be a problem. 
Do you know why? The distance from here to here will be 30. 30 cm plus s plus unknown. That is the distance from here to here. So the distance only here will simply be s minus 30. If here is s plus 30 cm, here will be s minus 30. Because if we finally get this complete distance, if you remove 30 from the complete distance, we will have here to here. You understand very soon. Look at it. Taking moments, we have 25 times 12 about this point is equals 15 times the distance is s minus 30. So this will simply be 25 times 12, that should be 300 is equals 15s minus 450. 300 is 15s minus 450. 300 plus 450 is equals 15s. S is equals 750 over 15. And 750 divided by 15 is equals 15cm. Now, we've learned two things from this observation. Since the mass is at 50 cm, it simply means that this is a uniform metal rule. And the center of gravity for a uniform metal rule is at 50 cm or is at the center. This is a uniform metal rule, which we would have assumed earlier. If we assume this to be a uniform metal rule earlier, we will know that here is the center. And if here is center, from beginning to the center is 50 cm and from here to the end is also 50 cm if we had assumed this earlier or we assumed uniform metal rule earlier you will see that here will be 50 minus 30 that is 50 minus 30 which will give you 50 minus 30 is 20 which will give you 20. what is our major task our major task is this part, which there is now adjustment. The distance is increased to 15 cm since the pivot has been moved to 33 cm mark instead of the 30 cm mark. And as this is being moved, from here to here, it remains 50 cm. Therefore, from here to here, we be 50 cm minus 33 cm let's look at that 50 cm minus 33 cm this should be 17 17 cm so from here m times 15 is equals 15 times 17 m is equals 17 since 15 cancels 15 so the mass here is 17 grams and the mass here is 25 grams before adjustment 25 grams to balance it. After adjustment, we needed 17 grams to balance it because the distance here has increased. As the distance increased, the lesser the mass we need to balance. So 17 and 25. 25 minus 17 is 8. So the question says, how much must the mass be reduced to maintain the horizontal balance of the rule? The mass was 25. And after adjustment, we needed 17 grams, which means the mass has been reduced by 8 grams. Which makes which option? Option A, the correct option. 17 is not correct because 17 is the new mass and not the adjustments made. Equilibrium of forces. This brings us to the end of this class. So, what do you do? Get the flash learner jam application. If you've not gotten, visit flashlearners.com. You'll see a lot of install options. Then oh, go to practice for UTME as the app opens. Click on physics. Under physics, these are the topics you should select equilibrium of forces, center of gravity and stability, rigid bodies, equilibrium of forces, couple, equilibrium of forces, particles. Equilibrium of forces, principle of moments, and equilibrium of forces, talk. Select these topics. 
it will bring out questions under all these areas. Reverse the one you saw and look at more questions. Apart from this, the app offers a lot of features. It is the best app to pass down. Even when I didn't do the series in the previous years, people use the app as the only few videos I released to score very high exams. Left alone, complete series, 120 videos, your own subject times 4, 700 times all the subjects I'm doing, about 700 something videos plus the app. If you don't score above 300, then something is wrong. Trust me. So that is it. Get the app, begin to practice. If you have any questions, reach me on my social handle. Take care of yourself.